hey baddies what's up so somewhere there was this invisible memo that all shoulder tops were out and regular t-shirts and the t-shirt that i'm wearing right now it actually gathered on up over those shoulders tucked in and threw a shoulder pad in so today we are going to talk about a trending fashion right now which is shoulder padded t-shirts and tops i'm actually already wearing one so we're not just going to talk about it you know i'm all about showing you guys so stick around today i'm going to talk about the shoulder pad t-shirt and i'm going to show you guys four ways to style it so if this is what you're trying to do today make sure you stick around yeah. Hey baddies, what's up? It's your girl Ashley Tamara. If you're new here, hey, if you already been rocking with me, hey girl, welcome back to my channel where I discuss all things fashion, lifestyle, food, travel, you name it. Um, of course, be sure that you are subscribed to the channel. And if you are, thank you so much. In addition to subscribing, be sure that you're hitting that like button and you're turning on that bell so you get a notification every time your girl makes a new post. So just like I told you before, not gonna hold you guys up long. We're gonna talk about this shoulder padded t-shirt or top. Um, so like I said, it's been this trend that just kind of started back over. It's very much giving 80s, but I love it. Um, I was just kind of shopping around and lo and behold, not only are the big brands like Zara, ASOS, Express, they're already hacking on this trend. You can find a shoulder padded top on Fashion Nova, but of course, I'm always going to slide on Amazon because they offer quality, it's a great price, and they ship really fast. So the shirt that I'm wearing today, it did come from Amazon. It was about $22. I'm just gonna untuck it so you guys can kind of get a full glimpse of what it's looking like. Um, it sits at the hips. It is like a cotton blend. Um, if you look on the sides, again, it's kind of tucked in. And this is the back of the shirt. So I did go with white simply because white is just, you know, it's a clean, fresh color. But if you're interested in getting this particular shirt, they actually have it in an array of colors, everything from beige to black to pink, whatever your palette, they have it. So just like I told you before, we're actually going to style this t-shirt four different ways. So that way, if you are kind of on the edge about getting a shoulder padded top, hopefully I can sell you on taking the final push and trying this super cute fashion trend. So let me go ahead and get changed. I'm actually halfway wearing one of the outfits, but let me get ready, ready for y'all. And I'll be back in one second. The first way that you can wear your shoulder pad top is with a pair of joggers or sweatpants. So what I've done here today, I simply have on these um, kind of like medium gray joggers that I found on H&M. I paired them with some tube socks. Let me get a little closer. Let's see if I can kick my leg up. Pow! I paired them with some tube socks and my New Balance 550s green and white. I also did another vlog on these showing you like four or five ways you can style these as well. So if you haven't checked that out, be sure that you slide over there, you know, finish watching this one first. And then, you know, if you decide to get these shoes, you know what to do anyway in addition to the shoes i actually paired it with this super edgy necklace i got this from project 2000 on instagram this is actually a black owned company run by a young beautiful young lady named Gigi. when i tell y'all this choker is all what it looks to be it is super heavy the quality is there and baby this choker is choking you hear me now, what I did for a hat, I just went with the LA Dodgers baseball cap. It matches with the shoes. So, you know, of course, if it's a nice spring day or a warmer day, you can stop right here with this outfit, but it is a little bit brisk out. I'm actually uh, gonna complete this look with a trench coat that I found on H&M. So this just kind of takes that shoulder pad, you know, of course the emphasis today is the shirt, but just a complete look, 
you could throw on a jacket, you know, as such. And then to finalize this look, I'm actually just throwing on a mini uh, Louis Vuitton BB Allen bag. So, you know, you're getting a full, edgy, but comfortable street style outfit while rocking this trend. And I ain't even gonna lie, when I'm done making this video, I actually got a little lunch meeting. And this is what I'm gonna wear today because what? <laughs> All right guys, so the next way that you can wear your shoulder pad top is with a simple skirt. So today I actually took this cute satin leopard skirt that also came from Amazon and paired it with my top. I did some uh, knee high overlapping boots. And for earrings today, I actually chose these handmade um, earrings made from my girl over at Atia Designs, a local designer here in Jacksonville, Florida. So, you know, Gideon, y'all see it, y'all see what's going on. There you go. So, yes, this is another super cute way to take your shirt and give it a little bit of sex day. But of course, I'm, just, I'm not gonna leave you guys with just the shirt and the skirt. This is how we're gonna finish it. So what I did was simply threw on a slightly faded jean jacket that I got from The Gap and a super oversized hobo bag. Listen, I have been wearing this bag almost every single day with my everyday outfits. This also came from Amazon, y'all. So if y'all are not shopping on Amazon, you are totally slipping. Of course, I'm gonna leave every single piece in the description for you guys, but this is the final outfit. This is, can be worn to work, out to lunch, you know, a casual date with friends, whatever. I told you guys, I'm done telling you where to wear this stuff. I'm just here to show you how to put it on. So this next trend, this just like the shoulder pad top, you would just be crazy if you haven't gotten in on this trend. And this is the cargo pants trend. Everybody and their grandma and their daddy and their mama are wearing cargo pants right now. You know, whether you're gonna do the Attico, the, the, that style with all of the pockets in the front, you know, the ones that's high at the bottom, make sure where you are jumping in on this simple trend that has made its way back to present day. So today we have um, some olive green wide leg cargo pants. I actually found these on Pretty Little Thing in the shape department. So they are actually designed to fit the waist how it's supposed to. Now, um, of course, we just simply tucked in our padded shoulder top. And what I did was pair it. Look, y'all just gonna keep making me throw my leg up. This with these um, Prada booties that I've had in my closet for like the last year or two. Don't know if you can find these online. They've been sold out, but I'll try my best to find something close. And for earrings, a simple pair of just some gold earrings that I found when I was in Los Angeles recently. So here you have a super cute, but always comfortable outfit. Not gonna leave you guys hanging. So this is how we're gonna finish the look. Just a simple leather jacket and a nylon oversized clutch. Of course, you can mix and match this however you please, but this is just another way for you to style your shoulder pad top or t-shirt. Last but not least, a surefire way that you can wear your shoulder pad top is with a simple pair of jeans. So what I did today is took a relaxed pair of light wash Levi jeans, um, just FYI. I actually had these tailored, total different topic, but if your jeans, if you're kind of in a situation with me when it comes to wearing the jeans that don't have stretch, I always go up to the size that fits my hips and then I have the waist altered. That way I still can rock the classic Levi jeans like everybody else, but they fit tailored to my body and shape. So that's just a little tip for you guys that are scared to buy the jeans that don't have stretch, get them altered. They actually do it at the Levi store here in town. So if you're in Jacksonville, that way you could try on the jeans and then the girl there, I can't think of her name right now, but she's amazing. She tailors um, jeans and pants for me all the time. Moving right along. So we took these jeans and paired them with a jewel pair of mules. Found these on ASOS um, for accessories. Of course, just some simple studs. But the showstopper here is this choker necklace that I found on Zara. 
not I'm almost 100% sure it's sold out but I would definitely try to find you know um, sort of some sort of alternative for you ladies if you are interested this statement piece goes well with t-shirts as you could see um, I wore it for the first time with the dress it is so cute it's so everything so not gonna do a jacket for this look but if you were to I would probably just throw on a simple leather jacket and I just have a simple uh, clutch so this gives you yet another way that you can style your shoulder pad top so baddies that's pretty much it for today i hope that this video gave you some inspiration on how to style your shoulder pad t-shirt if you love today's video if you love the looks drop your girl a couple of comments make sure you're liking this video so i know that y'all are digging what we doing here today um, and if you aren't already be sure that you are subscribed that way you can keep in touch every time i make a new post make sure you're turning on those notifications as well. Other ways that you can get more information on the topic of the shoulder pad top, um, there's actually a full dialogue on eatandbougie.com. I did a full write up, the links are gonna be there. I also have already dropped all of the links in the description below. Other ways that you can maximize, if that's the word, maximize, <laughs> I said maximize. Other ways that you can maximize um, getting style inspiration for the shoulder pad top. You can also follow me on Pinterest. That's right. I am officially a Pinterest pinner person. So if you actually click on there, if you look under the style section, I have a whole section dedicated to shoulder pad tops. And you can kind of poke around and find all type of different inspiration. I constantly update it because my job and my passion is to make sure I'm showing you guys how to get fresh so i'm gonna go ahead and wrap up today's video of course if you have any questions you can send me a direct message personally leave some comments i'm very active i will respond again thank you so much for watching until next video baddies bye